Hello everyone. Many people have been asking me for showing them how to provision our studio USB with Lens. So today, let's talk about it. Keep in mind that you can find all of this information in my blog. So now, as I mentioned on this blog post, there are different options to register your devices to Lens. Two of them are provisioning and DHCP. So let's get started. The first time setting up your studio USB or R30, you may need to type in the default password. You can go back to my blog and just copy and paste the default password if you need. Click enter and begin setup. Make sure that your system is connected to Wi-Fi and click on next. So now we need to go to lens. Now click on manage. Register device and here basic provisioning. We need to copy and paste these credentials. Let's do it. Set provisioning mode as manual. Um, just copy and paste. Set server type as HTTPS and click on X. That's all. On your system, you can see a network and a provisioning service, but you can make sure that it's connected to Lens. Getting back to Lens, of course. Go to your inventory and click on your new device here. And that's all. In case you have been using your R30 or Studio USB, you can see something like this. You need to provision your system with a service. So click on settings, admin, make sure that it's connected to a Wi Fi network. Um, here, provisioning service, manual, HTTPS, and just copy and paste your credentials. Again, click on Manage, Register Device, Paste Provisioning. So let's copy and paste our provisioning credentials. Username, Password, and click on Apply. That's all. Now our system is connected to a provisioning service. So what about the third method? Let's click on settings, admin, and select here, auto, apply. As you can see, we manually provision our system, but we don't need to do it. So that's where the HTTP and all options help us. So as you can see here, it gets the provision server from your DHCP. And that's all. All right. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and follow me on social media. Thanks.